Hi, I'm Klaus Hermann, founder and editor of Farbspielfoto.com, where we make your photography simple. This tutorial video is an excerpt of my personal workflow courses for Lightroom and Photoshop. If you're watching this prior to September 15th, 2015, you have the unique chance of snatching both courses as a free bonus. Just stick around till the end of the video where I will tell you how. And now, have fun with the tutorial. The final area that we need to work on, as you may recall from our little analysis in the, at the beginning, are those trees and basically all the vegetation that we have in, the, in this area here. And that requires us to create another group. Okay, so another group in the local adjustments area. Uh, we're just going to call it greens. And as we did before, we need to create a layer mask for that. And the way I'm going to do this is by looking <coughs> at those other masks here. And what you see when you look at those masks is um, that the green stuff, the vegetation, the green areas are actually uh, everything but the, um, the unity of all those masks that we have here. Okay, sounds a bit abstract, but I'm going to show you what I mean. Because what, I go what I'm going to do is I'm holding down the uh, control key uh, or command key on, on my keyboard and click on that first mask to select the what we have created as a sky mask. Then I'm, I'm holding down control and shift and click on the tower, tower layer. Okay, so that's added to my selection. I now have a selection that includes the sky and the tower. And finally, I'm going to do the same, holding down the Control and Shift key and click on the foreground. Now, and that has, has added the foreground to my selection. So now I've selected everything but the green stuff. And let me add that mask to the greens um, group here and show it to you. So here you see a mask where everything's white except the green parts. Now it's easy to fix that. I'm just going to press Control or Command I on my keyboard and it, it inverts that mask. And now magically, without doing any masking, we have a mask that only singles out those green vegetation parts, okay? So by having created all those prior masks, we eventually also created a mask for the final area that we want to work on, which, uh, which is the vegetation. Now, we can obviously pick the brush tool and, and black as the foreground color and um, remove some of those um, edge regions here to just clean up the mask a little bit. It's not too difficult to do. And then in no time we have a very nice mask which only gives us the, the green trees and the grass. Okay, so now we're going to Put in. If you're watching this prior to September 15th, 2015, you're lucky. Because you can snatch your free copy of my personal workflow courses for Lightroom and Photoshop, and here's how it works. Simply head over to the link below where the 5 Day Deal Team organizes the biggest bundle sale in the history of photography. It's running between September 10th and 15th, 2015. And this is your unique chance to get a huge bundle of high-class photography education and tools from the world's best photographers at an insane discount. No matter which type of photography you're into, this is the best investment you can make in your own photography. And in addition to that, you can even win over $50,000 worth in prices. If you purchase the bundle through this link, I will send you the download links to my full personal workflow courses within 24 hours. But please do make sure that you use this link to start your checkout process for the bundle. Otherwise I will not have your details and I cannot send you anything. So, I hope I'll see you for the 5 day deal event. Take care and have fun.